All right, so we got Madden 25 gameplay deep dive. Let's go to the video. Hey everyone. All right, here we go, y'all. Oh my God, my headphones are so loud. NFL 25 gameplay deep dive. All right, man. Here we go. We're talking about Boom Tech, which integrates real world physics into the Field Sense system, revolutionizing one on one tackling to give players ultimate control on the field. Okay. Physics based gameplay in Madden 25 delivers an all new tackling system, improved ball carrier balance logic, and a reloaded timing based hit stick, delivering increased gameplay variety. Oh, okay, I like that. Outcomes. I like that. A physics driven tackle in Madden 25 consists of three unique stages. So they're bringing back, they're bringing impact, back like, the, like the hit stick, impact, and post impact. As a result of the physics behind each one on one tackle, the same tackle start animation can produce countless results based on the factors like the combined momentum of the players, the angle of impact, okay. weight, speed, strength, and player range. So it's about like where you tackle him, basically? initiates a hit. You'll see the ball carrier anticipate the incoming defender and brace for contact. Here, okay. the player still has complete control to change direction or perform a skill move like a juke, truck, or stiff arm. Which affects the point of impact and resulting. Oh, wait a minute, hold up. Upon impact, the system considers various factors like timing, momentum, weight, speed, strength, and player ratings okay. to determine the power and direction of the tackle. Okay, so they got new tackling, tackling animations, like okay. A DB in the secondary or a player with less momentum may struggle to stop a strong runner who can deflect contact and gain extra So yards. wait, if you're if you're if your cornerback is weak, hand, he's basically getting like stuff a smaller ball carrier in their tracks with little to no forward momentum after the point of impact. Physics in Madden 25 informs one-on-one -on -one tackling from Ooh, one okay, nah, then, nah, that animation was hard. Control. That and animation was hard. The outcome they expect on every play. To celebrate its 20th anniversary, We've reloaded the hit stick with a new skill-based mechanic where a player's timing and angle of approach matter. If a tackle is timed too early or too late, its power will be reduced or less effective. Oh, no. But when no. a hit stick is timed perfectly, plays can hey. be stopped just as fast as they started. New on-screen feedback provides info on perfect hit timing, timing. Okay. While UI so they got feedback. Make a okay, it's kind of like uh, it's kind of like NBA 2K feedback. There's more to physics-based gameplay. Ball carrier than just balance tackling. system. With the new ball carrier balance system, players and he's going to be cracked in this game. Driven, broken tackles, McCaffrey, stumbles, oh man. And balance recovery reactions that are also determined by momentum and impact direction. Hit quality, That's rating, cheese though, and the bro. abilities of the players That's involved, a little cheese, as well bro. as the ball carrier's body position, will result in more variation and nah, realism that's cheese. in the run game. That's literal All cheese. I'm going to be honest with you. and tackling abilities have been modified to work together with the new physics system. And in some cases, new abilities have been created. For oh, no. He's never doing that. Check out the Gridiron Notes blog. Ooh. In the okay. NFL, I kind of like the Duke animation. Okay. Blocking a strategic chess match. And updates to pass blocking provide more control to adjust schemes. In Madden 25, players can choose between eight pass blocking adjustments before the snap. For the first time ever, visual cues will highlight each offensive lineman's specific target play art, as well as how this will change based oh. on the blocking scheme. But isn't that like cheese and milk? That's like cheese, for, right? Because be like... With the hot defender icon. So players can decide who to block and who to strategically throw hot off of. New pocket okay. building logic, right. along with hundreds of new blocking I'll, I'll animations, naturally boosts engage pressure to form the pocket more authentically. So quarterbacks can step up to make clutch throws when the protection well, is like, right. Well, like, this won't matter, like, if you have, like, the Indianapolis Colts. Like, bro, their yeah, O-line is horrible. introduces brand new catching mechanics. And or, or like, the uh, Cowboys. They're, 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 the bro, their lineup is more trash. catching variety and the ability to combine <laughs> catch bro, types together. this literally won't matter for the Cowboys. Grabs with the all -new no. No. Catch no. No, 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 a larger catch radius, no. No. But oh, no. 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 Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I'm raging. No. No. With this mechanic, I'm literally crashing out, bro. Modify aggressive run after catch and secure catch inputs. We should have had this in, in Madden 16. Type mid animation, which oh no, 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 no. Improvements give players the ability to pull off highlight worthy grabs with more control. On wait, wait, every so can any wide receiver just do one hand grabs? To just no more shot. No, no, carrier, no. We've revamped the right stick. See, he's to gonna be cracked in this game, y'all. Control. Oh, hold up. A new who's, Hezzy who's step that? combined with the new Ooh. fake out logic gives players the ability to trigger CPU defender breakdowns. 
from there. Okay, that was all right. Combo new back jukes, spins, cuts, and other skill moves. Oh, that's with Checo. Fakeouts that weren't possible. Ooh, before. okay. For added realism, both during gameplay and between snaps, we've introduced a variety of signature animations. Okay, Unique that... run styles for superstar players, <laughs> along with signature pre-snap behaviors from quarterbacks. He do run like he's stepping on a bug. The line between Madden 25 and the real game. Visible pre-play communication between players will also make the line of scrimmage feel more dynamic and alive, while intelligent adjustments and hand signals change based on the types of plays being called. For increased play calling depth, some of the most exciting new plays from the league have been added to each of the 32 teams' playbooks. Cheat Ohio. A few highlights from last season in Madden 25 include Miami's cheat motion and Kansas City's Super Bowl winning corn dog. Oh, the corn dog. I know that one. B, 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 like go these, B. There it is. route concepts and custom route stems change the length of the initial route for complete hot route. Y'all know Kansas City, that's, that's my With team. With the addition of the defensive switch stick, We've introduced a new defensive meta where players can quickly switch their user coverage with a flick of the right stick, adding control while lurking in the secondary on pass. Okay, I actually kind of like that feature. And Madden 25 will, of course, I include the new NFL hybrid kickoff rules where players can experiment with the new rules and strategies before we see it in the regular season. Wait, what's the new kickoff rules? Well, I don't the know. MVP bundle to get EA Sports All right, man. NFL 25 and EA Sports College Football okay. 25. All right. Now, if I'm being honest with you, right, first of all, a lot of the, we, we got like a lot of things that, to, you know, to cover. So let's start breaking them down right now. So uh, they start off with, with the with the hit animation and stuff like that. I'm going to be honest with you. It really depends on like, OK, so the um, like the Browns running back, or whatever that that what was it? I think his name's like Josh Gibson, or whatever, bro. He's going to be cracked. I know uh, CMC. He's going to be cracked like uh, Christian McCaffrey. He's going to be absolutely bro. He bro. He's going to break, like, every single tackle is going to be absolutely insane. I think he's, like, uh, like a 99 overall. He's going to be insane. Um, here's what I would say. It definitely does look different than, you know, College Football uh, 25 because, in my personal opinion, I thought it was going to look the same. I thought, like, I thought that both games were going to have, like, uh, like some similarities or whatever. Turns out both games really do look a lot different. Obviously, you, here's the thing. I thought that, like, since, you know, they were both by EA, I thought that, like, you know, both teams – that they want to have like the same team working on both games, but turns out this is gonna have like the Madden team working on the Madden game, and then like they, I'm guessing they form like a whole new like college football game. Sorry, college football team to work on college football, which makes sense. So, um, these tackling formats and stuff like that. Here's the thing, right? And again, I don't, I, I don't see how. Okay, cool. Like, let's say you have, uh, CMC running at you, whatever. So if you if you hit him too early, then he can like basically just brush it off. If you hit him too late, he can basically run through it. But if you hit him like you know like at perfect timing, then I guess like it's like a perfect pass or whatever. If I'm being honest with you, I think that should that should really just depend on like what type of running back you have. Because if I have a, a you know if I have like a 68 overall running back or whatever, and he runs the ball, and let's say um, I don't know who's a, who's a, who's a, who's, a, who's a, a linebacker, and I have um. Bro, I don't know. Let's say I have like a like a like an eighty five overall uh, linebacker. If I have a sixty eight overall running back, whenever and they collide with each other, but the linebacker hits my running back uh, slightly early and he like rubs off, that's not possible. Like that's not like that's not realism at all. You know. So if I have like a weak running back, you know, and but even though my you know my running back is weak, whatever, he can still shake off or like you know break tackles because of this new tackling feature. That's a little cheese, if I'm being honest with you, you know. But if I have, like, Christian McCaffrey, if I have Josh Gibson or whatever, and, and you know, I'm a 90-plus I'm overall whatever, then obviously I think it should make sense that they can break a few tackles or, or they have, like, sharp cuts or whatever, uh, and they can, like, you know, juke and get out of, like, you know, tackling formations and stuff like that. So I think that makes sense You have, if you have, a, like, a really good running back. But if you don't, then, like, like what, like, I guess everything really does come down to the tackle. It really don't matter about the players. I mean, it really does, but I'm guessing it really don't, you know, compared to, like, EA's uh, knowledge about it. Um, obviously, they, they're bringing back, like, the whole, like, you know, uh, hit stick or whatever. So that makes a lot of sense. These one-hand grabs, I'm going to be honest with you. These one-hand grabs should only be available to the top 10 receivers. Bro, there's no shot that a 70 overall can do the Odell Beckham one shot. There's no way. 
I'm being honest with you. There's no shot you should be able to do that at all, bro. If you are a 70 overall uh, wide receiver, bro, and you're making one hand, what like one handed catches like these, bro, there's no way. No, you are a 70 overall, bro. Seven zero. You deserve to make, bro, bro. At best, you can you can get a little uh you know uh what, what's the name Santonio Holmes little uh, toe tap. That's at best. You should not be making one hand grabs in the end zone. There's no way if you're a 70 overall. So I'm guessing that you know only the top 10. Well, I'm, well not even top 10, but I'm guessing that the top wide receivers can only do this. There's no shot that any random receiver can do this. There's no way. There's literally no. I, I mean maybe you know they're trying to like you know uh, make it fair I guess or whatever, bro. But like. These wide receivers just making random one-hand grabs, bro. That will legit make me quit the game. I can't lie to you. So, um, we've got the hit stick or whatever. We've got the ball carrier balance or whatever. Okay, cool. That's great. Um, what else? The pass blocking, like I said before. If your pass block, like, like if your team, let's say the Indianapolis Colts, they're, bro, their offensive linemen, bro. Shout out to you guys, bro. But the, their offensive line sucks. Uh, the Cowboys, their offensive line sucks. There is no shot. Obviously, like, you know, they're, they're trying to make it to the point to where, like, I'm guessing you could just hold uh, RT or R2 and uh, see, like, you know, um, what what defensive end or what defensive lineman, whatever, is going to, like, you know, uh, sorry, you're going to see what offensive lineman is going to block, like, you know, what defensive player, or whatever, that's coming through. I mean, I guess that's not really nothing. But at the same time, though, like, bro, like, if you have an offensive line, bro, if you have, like, a like a weak offensive line, like the Indianapolis Colts or, like, the Dallas Cowboys, that, bro, it won't matter. It literally won't matter, bro. Bro, their offensive line is absolutely horrible. So that, that whole thing of, like, oh, well, you get to see which one of your offensive linemen is watching whatever defensive linemen, it won't, bro, it, bro, it won't matter. If you're using the Cowboys, bro, first of all, bro, that press guy, he's going to get sacked 20 times, bro. Your offensive line is absolutely horrible. Okay, I, listen, I, listen, I'm a Kansas City Chiefs fan. You know, we just won a Super Bowl, so I really have no worries, to be honest with you. Like, bro, we're signing people from Europe, bro, like, as, as running backs. So, if I'm being honest with you, bro, I legit have no worries. So, you, of course, I'm not going to talk anything about my team. But to be honest with you, bro, listen, if you have a weak offensive lineman, bro, that won't matter. It literally won't matter. I'm just, I'm just keeping it honest with you. It, it legit won't matter. Uh, that catch and control thing, uh, more catch variety. Okay, cool. Um... What else? They added like new jukes, new moves. I do like some of the new jukes. Uh, signature authenticity, uh, if, I, if I said that right. Um, so I'm basically like, I'm, I'm guessing like whenever quarterbacks they're doing like their like their authentic, their, or they're doing like their signature like startup or like their sting, uh, their signature hike or whatever. Um, that's cool, I guess. Um, let me see. Uh, playbook update, they got some new plays, and, you know, and my boy, you know, Kansas City Chiefs, they got their Super Bowl winning uh, corn dog play that they ran on the 49ers, um, and so yeah, that's pretty cool, I like that a lot, defensive switch stick, I like that a lot too, that's actually kind of cheese for the defense, because let's say, let's say for instance, um, let's say for instance, I'm, because usually whenever I play Madden, and I'm on defense, I play the linebacker, no, sorry, I played a middle linebacker. I, so I played a guy that's in like the middle, or whatever. Uh, that's, I've been I've been doing that for like ten years, ever since I was like a little baby boy. So um, that's like my favorite like place to play or whatever. So whenever like I'm playing linebacker, or whatever, and I got the middle, or whatever, and I'm just guarding the guy that comes across. If you throw a deep ball, or whatever, I can legit just like bump left or right or like up whatever and i can go to the nearest uh person that i bumped up to and i could be watching like the wide receiver that's getting the ball thrown to and i can have a chance to pick it off that's actually pretty cheese i like that a lot that's really nice that, that's a really nice thing but if i'm being honest with y'all man um i here's the thing i think a lot more people already are gonna get you know um college football 25 some people are going to get Madden. Let's not act like, you know, Madden's not going to get anybody. I mean, Madden's just classic. Uh, you know, people are still going to get Madden. But if I'm being honest with you, bro, uh, College Football 25 definitely took all the hype away from Madden. Uh, because, I mean, it, it, you know, it makes sense. But we haven't, you know, played College Football 25 since like 2013, 2014. So if I'm being honest with you, bro, it's about time it came back. And, I mean, there's, there's not really a loss because, you know, um, EA, I mean, EA made both games. Like, they made both football games. So, if I'm being honest with you, it's not really a loss. It's more like a win, you know, because you have two football games dropping. And one did really well, you know, that's been gone for, like, 11 years. And one is doing, like, one. I mean, this Madden will probably do, like, average. Maybe, like, less numbers since, you know, they already bought, like, a football game. Or you might have those people that actually just might buy, uh, buy both. So, comment down below, man. What do you guys think about this deep dive, this Madden 25 deep, da uh, deep dive? I'm over here messing up my words. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for them out. And peace.